I'm Ash from Ash for Entertainment, and welcome to this story-based episode of Rust. But first, a quick question. What's the two most annoying things you can think of in Rust? If you said dog campers and roof campers, you would be correct, or at least it is for me. But on this episode, I decided to become a said dog camper, after these neighbours ruthlessly murder me. But anyway, don't forget to leave a like if you like the video and stay subscribed for more videos such as this. I'm enjoying doing the more story-based videos. Anyway, sit back, relax and enjoy the door camping. See you later. Oh, not bad, a little bit of a decay here. Oh, it's not even been looted either. Oh, I'll take your, I'll take your furnaces, mate. Don't mind if I do. It's a big help, that. No fuel. Take this. Cheers, mate. This one, yeah. Get all these recycled afterwards. I'll get me sent a tier one sort of that. Shut up, phone. I'm trying to work here. <laughs> it's always when I'm trying to record something with one goes. Oh, fucking hell. Scripted content. <laughs> dead but I don't think I can repair it. You can repair workbenches can't you? You can repair everything else normally so I'm hoping you can repair this thing. Oh sweet yeah. Not bad got a tier one we can start. You know Rusty is quite a nice game when you think about it when you're all alone. Peaceful. Oh shit! Hey, come here. Sort of a oh fuck two. Oh shit, I fuck it half ah, shut. Sure. Ah fuck. Aren't you? Are they together? Nah, I wouldn't batter this mate if we were together. I'm sat outside this house that I saw about half an hour ago. It had no walls. But I've noticed there's people walking around in here, so I'm wondering if it's the guy that killed me. It's worth a shot. How many doors has he got? Hmm. It's a better. Vegeta, he stole your dude. I'll kill him. Fuck him. No door. Damn right, I'm serious. Not doing my shit back. Bitch. So if he lives there. And he's got my clothes. Where's that other fucking guy that killed me? That bloody catalyst fucking fella. Oh. Fucking guns everywhere and all. Come back, you cunt. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's your friend. That didn't sound like him. So the door lived there. How the fuck did that not kill him? Shit. Fucking hell. Oh, oh. Jeez. Don't know what the fuck I'm doing here. Oh shit, he's up roof. The son of a bitch rage quit. <gasps> Satchel! Oh, ma. Oh, for fuck's sake. Nothing like doing a bit of Sir Winter.
Oh shit, he saw me. You bastard. How did he see me? But he out in, out looking. Oh, oh. Down, boy. Ooh, fire on us, I like that. See you later, bitch. This suck at Bowen. Ah! Oh, fucking hell, that was loud. No, no, no. Run away. I don't want him to know where I live. Are you tired of being dark camped by grubs? Rolled on by clans? Coming back to seeing your base broken into and raided? Well I've got a server just for you. It's the abandoned PvE hardcore server. The server has many mods to make Rust a little bit easier. It has a farm mod with a level up system so the more you mine, the more you level up and the more resources you get. But I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, PvE? No that's not for me, I want to still kill people. But don't worry, it's got that covered. Each and every monument has scientists on them. So if you want to go for your daily shop at the sperm cat market, there will be scientists roaming around on the roof and inside, and sometimes around the front. Even if you want thinking to yourself, ah, that's not too bad, there's even Bradleys at the main monuments. So harbour, water treatment, places like that will have a Bradley roaming around. And if you manage to take down one of these Bradleys, it'll spawn tank crewmen. So more bots for you to fight. But the main thing is, you can build happily wherever you want, without the risk of someone coming, breaking in your doors and nicking all your hard earned loot. Also if you break barrels, you get little surprises. Surprises could be out from an airdrop, which spawns more scientists, bears, scientists, these zombie freaks with chainsaws, or even an explosive to keep you on your toes. The server is friendly, I've met many of my rust friends on here, and the admins a very friendly tool and able to help with any problems you might have. So if you want to check out the server, I'll leave a link in the description to the Discord group. Hope to see you there, and enjoy the rest of the show. Been gone for about two or three hours now, so they will probably think I've gone offline. Let's get this thing skinned now anyway. What the fuck? Where's my wall? <laughs> oh, I wonder if it was them that's just tried raiding me. Fucking bastards. You know, it's, I don't like bloody mining roads or whatever you call it, taking out barrels. Because there's always a house nearby and I always get nervous when there's a twig around it. There's always a, probably a sentry or someone right, right around the corner. Oh shit! Bastard, take this! Jesus Christ. Fuck, fuck you with a shit shot. Bandit. The dog camped the fuck out of him now. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ooh. He's coming out for that. Oh, perfect mate. Fucking hell, how many doors has this guy got? Boom! Fucking nothing. I'm taking your shit. My neighbours haven't been on for a while, so I'm deciding to raid. No, I'll read them before they read me. Yes, I know what I said, read me. Doors we got left. Is it open? I think I've left the door open. Right, I've got my lad. 
Ладно, не знаю. Someone raided them already. No, still stuff here. Oh, ooh, wood. I need that. Yeah. Oh, shit. Don't come in here, don't come in here. Oh, fuck me. Hello, mate. How are you? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Chill out, dickhead. Open door. No, I don't think so. Jesus Christ. Brush him. Get a lock on that quickly. Open the door. How about no, you fucking dickhead? Oh, stones. Oh, excellent. Enough for two. Yeah, excellent. It's sealed, lads. Two very boring minutes later. I wonder if they've gone through this one. I wonder if they're in here. Ooh, tier two. The fuck is this base layout? Fuck! That raid were a bit of a bit of a shit show. I've still got some satchels left. Sorry, I forgot my words. But there's a raid space over there that's almost been raided through. It's only got like one garage door left. So I'm here with nine. Two. What the fuck were the timing on that? I don't know about you, but that was fucking quick as anything. Anyway, back again. In. Two chests. TC. Molly, Molly. Excellent. Give me the loot. Uh -huh. Fuck no. Come on, some. Hi, thanks for watching. If you liked what you saw, leave a like and subscribe because I'm planning on doing more Rust videos. Also, don't forget to check out my socials, my Twitter, Instagram and all that. I upload pictures of games and such. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye for now.